Hi folks, um, I bought some final cabinet drawers, which I'm planning on using on a, um, a welder, but I like the industrial look, so I'm going to strip these down and make, go back down to steel. And uh, So let's start with an 80 grit disc on a sander. Let's let's start let's start taking the labels off. So heat gun and a scraper. Right, these little bits will sand off once we get the sander on it. I actually made a mistake buying these because the handles are actually riveted in. So you can't take the handles off, so I'm going to have to be careful when I'm sanding around the handles. But let's take the drawers out and sand the carcass first. To do like around here I'm going to use a Dremel with a little sander on it but you get the idea you'll have to do that with all five drawers and finish off with a Dremel so this has to be done all over the box and then we'll rub it down with the next step of sandpaper the lower grade of sandpaper Done with the uh, 80, then 120, final, final one, 240. Um, because it's going to be used as gauge, it's, it's not going to, I'm not going to polish it up or anything, I'm just going to sand it down and give it a bit of a spray wheel lacquer. <laughs> give it a shiny finish. It doesn't have to be perfect, it's, it's going in the garage but you can make it better if you spend more time on it. After sanding with 240 that's what you're left with. Um, you could go even further and sand it with wet and dry, 1500 wet and dry and that'll bring it up really shiny but because I'm using them in the garage I'm just going to spray with a bit of clear lacquer and um, leave it at that. Um, if you're using them as a piece of furniture then I'd say go a bit further with the finer sandpaper. But as I'm not, I want them to look quite industrial anyway so I'm going to leave them as is and just spray with a bit of clear lacquer. just to protect them from rusting. So I've clamped the frame together and I've put the top bit on an angle. So it's all clamped together ready to weld and that's what I'm going to be doing now you can see that I've put the top shelf at an angle so the welder is at a bit of an angle it's all ready to go just a few more things to do put the handle on chain for the bottle a couple of hoots to hold wires and earth strap and that, I'll get to it. 
just weld them on and then I've got to paint it. So all that's left now is uh, a bit of paint and to put the drawers in. I've used the, uh, the old handle to make a handle. Hooks for the earth wire, chain for the bottle. And that's where the drawers will go and it fits underneath. Paint it first, then put the drawers, and then it's done. And I've got a trolley made from an old supermarket trolley. So I'll, I'll paint it now and then come back with uh, the finished article. Drawers have come up quite well, the finished article completed. I think it cost me about a tenner. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye now, till next time.